Short-term rental companies like Airbnb, VRBO, and HomeAway are blooming right here in Florida. And if you use those websites to book vacations, this story will probably impact you. Right now, Florida lawmakers are moving forward with a bill that could change who makes the rules for those short-term rentals. First Coast News reporter Juliet Dreyer asked Jack's Beach residents how they feel about the constant flow of people in and out of their neighborhoods. It's getting to be that time of year when people flock to the Jacksonville beaches for a week or weekend trip away and they can rent places just steps away from the sand and ocean. But for people who live here year round, they have mixed emotions about the constant stream of people coming and going nearby. The Florida House approved House Bill 425 on Friday, moving it on to the Senate. The bill says local governments can only regulate vacation rental properties as they would all other homes, rental or not. One Jacks Beach resident I spoke with today says she sees people come and go in rental properties all the time. She says it can lead to major parking problems and loud noise into the early morning. They party and you don't obviously don't want to call the cops on them, but since this house is so old, when you're trying to sleep, it gets really, really aggravating and super annoying. A representative from Jacksonville Beach tells me the city does not regulate short-term rentals and never has. But an Atlantic Beach representative says they don't allow the rental of private homes for under 90 days. Tonight,